Hey guys, I am back. It's the Pretty Wolf. If you are new to my channel, welcome. So in today's video guys, I am going to show you how to make your lashes extra longer and also how to make your curl last. So when we're talking about how to make your curl, la curl last, we need to make sure that we are using the right product and in today's video guys I am going to show you which product I'm using and this video is going to be very very simple and quick so I can't wait for you guys to see the video let's get started Alright guys, I am ready to show you how I add extra length into my lashes and of course how to make your lash curl. First thing that I wanted to show you is your lash curler. So your lash curler should be, um, it suits your eye shape. Um, when, when you try to curl your lashes, it shouldn't hurt. I feel like this is the right size for my eyes. It's not too big. It's not also really like curvy, which is... Um, suit for my eyes so this one no matter what how i curl my lashes it doesn't hurt me it doesn't pull my lashes so it's really really good for that and of course the mascara that i'm going to show you i think this mascara is really the best for making your curl last and with the trip up uh, trick with a tip that i'm going to show you how to add an extra length um, any mascara you can do as long as you have the right product but this is really the best one that I have discovered lately so we'll get into that in just a moment and just get ready with my mirror here and I'm also going to zoom you in guys so that you can see the details when I apply the mascara bam alright you guys you are zoomed in and I am ready so I'm going to show you guys how I curl my lashes so this is my curler like I have said earlier so first thing that I want to do is curl my lashes in like closer to my lash line so make sure that it's the right angle and then just start pressing what I normally do is I'm going to cut 1 to 20 and then just leave it like that so 19 and 20 so that's about that's more than 20 because I was talking and then I, I don't leave it like that. So the other thing that I wanted to do is to curl my lashes in the middle. And again, count till 20. And then you can let go. So that is about 20. And then I would curl it on the very end again. And then curl, curl, and then count to 20. One more time and this time on the very end because I have so much space like I mean I'm not really pulling my lashes I'm going to bend it a little bit so as you can see I'm doing this motion so then it's 20 it doesn't really hurt me because I am curling my lashes to the very end of my um, hair and then what I'm gonna do again is going back closer to my lash line and then I'm gonna do this way because you guys I'm telling you I have probably the straightest is that a word <laughs> it's like my lashes is like like that so I really have to make sure that I curled it properly and this does not really take a lot of time if I'm not demoing you have to consider what is the size of your lash curler like sometimes they might be too big for your eyes um, they might be too small it's too curvy or it's too straight there's a lot of option I think for that you just have to make sure that you have the right product with you so now I am ready to show you guys this mascara I did not mention the name so this one is Maybelline total temptation waterproof so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab the product so just like the normal also the other thing that I'd like to mention while we're here is you don't want to do with this with your mascara okay never do that with your mascara because it's going to dry it really quick so just make sure when you're taking the brush make sure that you get enough product right there just kind of like grind it inside and then just pull it and then if there's any um, excess on the end just kind of like um, wipe it on the edge or in the edge of the mascara so now here we go I'm going in so I'm gonna do is I'm gonna coat my lashes in the very bottom like where the closer to my lash line because this kind of trick is going to add volume 
Okay, so you just want to kind of use the tip of the wand of mascara and then start building up. So as you guys can see, I already have that kind of like a little more depth into the lash line, which is we wanted. So that's what I want. Can you see that guys right away? The volume is what I'm looking for as well. And then to add an extra length onto your actual lash lashes, I'm going to do on just on the tip of my um, lashes, I'm going to focus on the tip. I'm not going to focus in the middle because I don't want to put too much product in it again. Like if you wanted the lengthening volume, do not put too much product. So I'm going to focus on the tip and just lightly add that. If you can see how I add it. Just on the tip, you guys should remember. And very, very light because sometimes if you put too much pressure on the brush, you might find it messier or you might find it you put too much product on the tip. So there you go guys, that is the first coat that I did. As you can see, I'm not sure if you can tell on my eyes, but I'm really loving it right now. So the second thing that I wanted to do is just kind of like build this up. So when you try to put the first layer of your mascara, make sure that the mascara it's a little bit dry. Don't put when it's still um, kind of wet because I feel like you'll get more clumpier right there. Um, but if you just kind of like it's about to become dry. So then that's when you want it to kind of build up. So that's what I'm doing. And I promise to you guys this curl will last if you use this mascara and if you have the right curler all right so I'm going to show you that's my lashes guys can you believe that and this is going to be my lashes for the whole day and I, I'm, I'm really loving this mascara and I'm so thankful I I got it so with this kind of mascara guys you just have to be a little bit more patient when you apply because um, this is not something that you just stroke and then it should be like that of course you have to do a little bit more careful when you apply you have to use your you know use your your judgment how to how you want your lashes to look like if you want your lashes to kind of like go a little bit into the inner corner of your eyes then of course you want to stroke it like a little bit um, like that and it's gonna just buff up if you just want to to make your lashes to go a little bit more outside more of a wing out um lashes of course you want to stroke from in to out so just do the same thing and um for sure you're gonna get the result use the same product and of course make sure that you curl your lashes properly the product that we talk about today is the mascara and the curler so it's very simple it's really quick but it's very very useful for you guys if you don't want to wear any false lashes so the mascara is the total temptation from Maybelline this is how it looks like and of course my curling lashes is from NARS it's the best for my eye shape if we have the same eye shape maybe it will work for you still try maybe it's not this is not we we don't have the same you know we are all different so make sure that you try it first and yes guys that's everything if you do like this video please give it a thumbs up and also leave a comment down below if you have any suggestions and of course please subscribe on my channel and hit that notification bell so that you are notified whenever i upload my next video thank you guys for watching and i will see you again on my next one Bye guys!